Yo guys, what's going on? It's Carl here at Formality Gamers, and uh, we are back with more City Skylines. Video number five, episode number five, shall I say? And yeah, I see here it's coming along pretty well. In the last video, we did finally expand to our lovely hillside area over here across the lake river. Lake? It's not a lake. This is more like a lake here. Here we go. But yeah, across the river, and we have finally expanded, and we're building on new ground. So yeah, this is quite good. We're finally expanding outwards. We are starting to lose quite a bit of space, though, so we have to look at expanding pretty soon, which I do not mind. We are starting to nearly get to the point where we can have our high residential zones, like our big massive skyscrapers and our offices and big massive malls and shops like that so yeah it's quite a lot to come and yeah so I need to start thinking about buying a new tile and new ground so we can be ready for these big massive humongous buildings that will be coming into our city so where to start what I'm, what I'm thinking about is I'm going to leave this area here alone for a bit because this is going to be like what I was thinking it's over here towards over these sides and stuff because it's nice like rivers areas and such as what I was thinking about this side is like making little country roads that have tiny little cities or villages or whatever you want to call them like this attached with it like I don't know with a little wind turbine to power on or something like that I don't know but yeah, I was thinking about doing that, having like little villages about this size, plotted around random in random spots, and keeping the main dense city areas across to a different side. And another plan I do have is because we are starting to get quite a bit of city and quite a bit of residents in our city, and we have a kind of a biggish work area that we have to do expand on as well because like we're getting high demand. So we do have to expand on our industry work as well. So what I was planning was to add a nice little bus route in for people who don't want to travel in their cars and such as. And it would encourage people to use the bus routes, which means it will save budget on cars, running cars and such as. And we'll get more money coming in from actual bus fares and such as. So I was planning on building the bus station around here and feeding onto the highway pieces here. So, yeah, we'll have to get around to doing that at some point, but not just yet. So, what we can do is we can uh, finish off this road here, bring that down, slope too steep. So, we'll bring that to about here then. And we'll bring this one to about here. What we could do actually is we could line these up. So we'll destroy this one. That comes to a. Do you know what? Just to make it a lot easier for me. Does that come across nicely? Yes, it does. Because then it builds the hill for me as well. And it's pretty even, so I'm happy with that. And what we can do is we can build our nice lovely grid area over here. And before we do that, and before I do forget, we need to... Yeah, we need to change these to one way. So we'll get the upgrade tool. Is there anything assigned to... No, it's just milestones. I might... What road is that? That is... One way... I don't even know what one way road that one is. Is it that one? I don't even know. Oh, 
Okay, I don't, I don't know what. Because I quite, I, I would have liked to have kept that green stripe going across the bridge, but is it that one? Nope. But that one's got a nice path to it anyway, so I think we'll keep that. We'll keep that one. We'll make this one way, which it is going the right way. Oh wait, we didn't even. So that's going the right way. That one is not. Now it is. That's brilliant. One way going in, one way going out. We'll make that one way as well. And what we can do now. Oh, I think I found the road. Yeah, I found it. It was that one. It had bicycle lanes. They didn't make a one way with bicycle lanes there. That's a bit. Of a shame. That would have been nice. Um, but anyway, what we can do is maybe we can add them in now because I did like the green stripes going down the side of the road. It did have a nice little design to it. So what we can do is with the industry part, I don't mind making it kind of a grid layout because it kind of suits it as well with all the factories being blocky and such as. See, I was thinking about joining these two up, but with the flow of traffic that would be coming in and out, maybe, possibly, I don't know. I don't know how, I can't predict how the traffic will be, but by the looks of it, there is a lot of traffic here. That's, I don't get why they're not using this lane here. Why aren't they using this lane? What? I don't know. They're all going left. Okay. Alright, we might have to try and sort that out because that is fairly odd. They all want to go left. Um, let's not worry about that now. Let's carry on with our industry work. But as you can see there, that's a good example is we need to keep this flow of traffic going so yeah I'm quite happy with that as it is and what we'll do is we'll carry on building our industry over here And over here, like this. And we can build a road going like this. I don't know because I was planning on making this part here industrial as well and because you can see boats over here once we do eventually get boats which will take a very long time because we need a population of 28,000 but once we do unlock the boats you can kind of see how they travel there so we might even need to build a docking station there or something but we can try and build a nice ship line coming across to our city over here. So I'm going to make this part industrial as well as this part here. And this part is going to be industrial. And a good majority of everywhere else is going to obviously be residential and such as and commercial. So I think I'll take this road out. Wait, no, I'll keep that road in because I'll bring the bridges over there. So I'll keep this road going to over here. Nope, I've done that one wrong. We'll make this grid here as well.
And we're not going to zone this area just yet. Well, no, we're going to zone some parts of it. We're not going to zone all of it. Because there will be high demand for electricity and such as. And we need more residents more than industrial at the moment. Even though there is high demand for industrial. But once you start building these buildings, they'll, that demand will go straight down. Whereas residential, people just carry on wanting so what we'll do let's see how this will go there we go quite like that nice little nice little zone this is There we go, I quite like that. Quite a nice chunky area to expand upon for our industrial. And what we'll do is we'll start zoning some parts of this up. Because I don't really want to zone up this, the highway piece. Because people will get obviously parking and the trucks will pull in and out and it will just cause a load of havoc. So we'll zone up these parts here. How are we looking on garbage disposal at the moment? 27% usage. We'll be able to buy our incinerators soon anyway, so I'm not too worried about that because we'll have our incinerator way before 50% is full. Um, is there coverage over here? Yep, yeah, there's plenty of coverage, that's good. How about fire department? Yep, yeah, we need to buy, build a little fire station over here. Build one that. Just to keep this area safe from fires, obviously. And we need to cover this place with water. Oh, that's a shame. I wanted to try and kill. Get all that area with one pipe, but it won't work. Um, yeah, that that area is covered. How are we looking on electricity? Oh, okay, we're running a bit low on electricity, so we can try and. F oh no, we can't. So there ain't no noise spots for it. 15, 13, 12. Nah, it's not really worth it. That's not really worth the price either. Let's see, I might get. One of these put in. And that was one of my dogs. 16. Oh, was that 17 I've seen there? Nah, the highest I'm going to get is 16. So I'll place that about here. Because the build, industrial buildings that get built here will spread that electricity over. So we'll build them like that. We're not going to fill the whole area out, like I said, because we want our demand for residents. The reason why I did build it like that fairly odd was so the buildings did spread over to this area over here, so we didn't have to build any power lines. So what we'll do is we'll play the simulation. We'll get some money coming in. Oh yes, beautiful. They built here straight away. We're losing a lot of money somewhere. Where's our money going towards? Electric, education, fire department. Right, we'll have to keep an eye on that. I don't like how this traffic is getting backed up here. Where is that going to? Everyone's trying to go left, okay. So, got one of two options. I can build a side road coming off here. Which 
you know what? I think I might do that. I might make a one lane system coming off here. Or maybe two lane systems. Like so. Oh, did not wrong. Oh, did not awfully wrong. Right, let's try that again, shall we? So we want that to come there, but we also want this to be a slope here. Be too much of a we need to turn snapping on. There we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring on possibly what I can do is I can upgrade these roads as well here yeah, going all the way down here and all the way down here these roads here this this basically oh it's tough this part um because this flow of traffic is causing a lot of disruption and we do not want it backing up we certainly do not want it backing up all the way around because it will cause problems. See, we can just carry on building our one way roads going across here. We need to carry on playing to get our money. See, we don't want to go too much into the middle part either because we have got our bus route plans. We can build. Now we'll build from this side. Oh, like spoke that, but that is because of the auto save. Um, Sleep. Stoke to sleep. Stoke to sleep. I don't want it. I'm going to build that one to about there. There we go. And what we need to do is we need to obviously make one go the other way will be this one. Oh. Hopefully people will start using this road. Oh I can s I see now. I see where the traffic's coming from. I'll see where partly where the traffic is coming from. It's coming straight from up here. Right, 
Okay. So maybe we could... Our money just built up really quickly. We just spent like all of it to 50 grand. I'm happy with that. <laughs> so yeah. Our traffic's coming up mainly from here as well. See, I thought it was coming from this side, but obviously I didn't really see. But this will help it anyhow. Because you can see all the traffic here. And all it'll take. We've got high demand for residential, but we'll leave that for next video. So what we'll quickly do is we'll pause it here. Is there are some adjustments we can do to this roundabout to make things speed up a little? But before we think of doing anything like that, what we can do is we could build a road. up and over like so and joining on about there there we go I quite like that and what we can do is for people who want to come are oh, coming from this area because I really don't want to use this space up because I want to build this for stations. So we can just have one coming down like here. I'll tell you what, in fact, we'll make come come about. About there. There we go. That's a steep hill, but people know how to use their brakes, so that wouldn't be a problem. I don't like this curve here, but with the way it is, I think I might have to leave it that way. What we'll do is we'll see how people get along with that. People are still not using it because they want to go down this bit. I basically just wasted my time doing that bit because people are only doing it to go down this road here because they can't be bothered to go off here and come. Sorry about that, guys. The video cut off yet again. My sis my um, software crashed out. Well, there's, I think there's a time limiter on it that I don't know about, but I need to look into the settings of it because second time it's done it. But yeah, I'll check. I'll check that out afterwards. Oh, a lot of abandoned buildings here. Because there's no people going to the jobs. Because we need high demand for residential. Right. Okay. We'll sort that out next video. But what we can do is to conclude this video. Because I was about to finish up with the video. But what we can do is these are one way. And what we can do is we can swap this one way. this side yeah we can swap that one way go on that side so it will go that way that way that way and that way And we've got a bunch of abandoned buildings over here that we need to destroy because no people wanted to get jobs over there. But what we can do is we can expand residential over here and bring real bridges over for them to get little jobs there. So we'll think about doing that next video as well. 
But yeah, we'll see how this... Why is people... I don't get... I don't get why they are going to that bit. Oh, because they were in the wrong lane anyhow. Okay, right. There we go, we've got some people using it now. That's okay, that's good. There we go, I'm happy with that. It's finally sorted itself out. Yep, I'm I'm good with that. Right, I think that is time to wrap it up now. So thank you guys for watching episode 5 I'm sorry that it kind of cut well it didn't kind of it actually did it like cut the video in two halves again but we'll get them edited together so thank you guys for watching and hopefully I can sort out the video recording problems because there is some sort of time limit on because it's around every 20 minutes where it cuts out so I think I need to look into getting more the different software or Maybe cutting down video timing or trying to see whether I can change the settings of it somewhere. But I have no idea, guys. But, anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any suggestions on what you want me to do, or any improvements, maybe, I don't know, or if you guys are just simply liking it, then comment also down below what you think I could do. Anyways, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.